In the previous section, we see that the system of linear equation can have exactly one solution, infinitely many solutions, or no solution. In this section, let us see how planes can come into play in the system of linear equations. To begin, let us consider a system of three linear equations with three unknowns. Notice that each equation resembles the equation of a plane in Cartesian form. The system of three linear equations can be interpreted as the Cartesian equation of three planes. Solving this system of equations is the same as finding the set of common points among the three planes. Let us go further and consider each case of different number of solutions. In case 1, suppose that the system of linear equations has a unique solution. Thinking of the three equations as planes, this means that there is a unique point of intersection among the three planes. This can be illustrated in how the planes are oriented in the diagram below. Notice that in the diagram, the three planes intersect at exactly one point. In case 2, suppose that there are infinitely many solutions to this system of linear equation. Thinking of these three equations as planes, this means that the three planes intersect along a line. This can be illustrated in how the planes are oriented in the diagram below. Notice that in the diagram, the three planes intersect along a line. In case 3, suppose that there is no solution to this system of linear equations. Thinking of these three equations as planes, this means that the three planes do not all meet at a common point. This can be illustrated in how the planes are oriented in the diagrams below. In this case, the three planes may be oriented either all parallel to each other, exactly two planes parallel to each other, or the three planes forming a prism. Let us summarize what we have gone through so far. We have seen that we can make use of knowledge about planes to interpret the number of solutions of a system of linear equations. How the planes may be oriented in each case where the system of linear equations have a unique solution, infinitely many solutions, or no solution. Do you think there could be more relationships between SOLE and planes? Do not hesitate in asking questions. Jot them down, you may post questions on the discussion forum at the end of the learning module.